Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Avis, welcome back to an episode. In today's episode, we're doing something pretty special. We're taking a look at all of the bandanas from the UGC catalog. And I think this episode might be quite interesting since we've never did something similar like this before. So let's just start the video. All right guys, there we go. Background music is running, of course. So let's just head to the avatar shop and let's find all of the bandanas. And I was thinking about this for quite some time and someone actually requested it as well. Um, sadly, I forgot the username, but they wanted me to showcase all of the bandanas that we have received over the past, like, I think nearly a year now. I think it's been actually nearly one year since the UGC catalog kind of came out. And it's been a long time. So you can see over the past year we've gathered quite a few of the bandanas. And I don't even know where to start to be honest. Let's just start at the first one right here. We have the 2v bandana. We should maybe go for recently updated so we like can kind of separate them um, from the start to finish. So these were kind of the first bandanas I assume we have received. Yeah, these were like the first ones. Uh, they were like kind of camo flush themed, uh, which is pretty cool overall, and I kind of like that. Uh, we have this woodland camo bandana for 100 robux, so the pricing was pretty high actually for a bandana, because if we take a look at certain bandanas from Roblox in the past, um, we see either similar pricings or fairly lower pricings, depending of course off, uh, on the bandana. So like, don't get me wrong. As an example, if we take a look, I think the bandit was 40 Robux. Yeah, there you go. That's like the first one. Then we have the nice red bandana. I don't know. This one was 150. This one was a bit more expensive. But then we have, I think the Jacko bandana was a little bit cheaper, like 50 Robux. And... There we go, 50 Robux, and this one was like 300 Robux, so that one is pretty expensive again. And these one were 15 Robux, so like, um, you kind of get the price point. So like, the, the first ones that we received were like 100 Robux, which is in my opinion, like, fairly high for like, bandanas. But they do look great, so I guess it's kind of understandable. 100 Robux from Urius, pretty cool. Those were the first bandanas we have ever really received on the UGC catalog, as far as I'm concerned. So like, we have Desert, Arctic, you get the point. We then have received the Toofy Bandana, which was um, pretty interesting because it's like one of the creepy items from the UGC catalog and to this day I think it's still pretty scary. Um, it makes for some great item uh, outfits, especially with this kind of just design overall, it looks pretty amazing. Also the detail on the tooth, pretty great. We then have received some other ones, like Bandana of Conflict, which is pretty cool again, very similar to his previous ones. I think you just change the textures there, but that's totally understandable. Then Damascus Bandana 2 for 100 Robux. The Bandana of Conflict surprisingly was only 30 Robux. I assume it's for the textures, I guess. I, I don't know. I'm not quite sure how this works for his pricings. Uh, we then have received the Sad Bandana, the Cat Bandana, uh, White Bandana. And this is the time where Maple Stick actually started making bandanas. And that was pretty much a change a little bit. Because before that, we have these like pretty thin looking bandanas and they they look fairly similar to the bandit um, Roblox has made. But if we take a look at the most popular bandanas from Roblox, at least in my understanding, we have these ones. And not, not in particular the Blizzard Beast Mode one, but just this kind of mesh that was used for the Blizzard Beast Mode ones. Like right here, let me just find it. Like the ones right here. These are kind of the popular bandanas that you're gonna see on Roblox. Uh, from the mesh at least and that started to happen as soon as maple stick kind of kicked in with like his bandana series you see these all look fairly similar and then maple stick comes in and they look a lot more similar to these ones which is i think a lot more liked by the community as you can see this one has 2900 and then let's take a look at some of these these one have like also 2900 okay i guess that wasn't the point that i was trying to make maybe we should take a look at some more colors here and maybe we're gonna find some more popular ones in the process so you can see maple stick has made a ton of these like literally a ton of these there is a huge variety of these 1000 favorites okay so this one is not as popular as the white one we have 2500 7400 um 9300 800 so the the plain ones are not that popular apparently which i guess i can understand we have the pink cat bandana pretty cool looking 600 favorites 1000 favorites orange banana with only 400 favorites so you see bandanas don't seem to be that popular at least from like the favorites perspective so that's quite interesting then we have received two right here again from urbanized this time which look again fairly similar to the ones by urius um I don't know if they kind of shared the mesh, but the mesh looks extremely similar. Well, whatever. Anyways, let's have a look at all of this stuff right here now. Um, we have the fire bandana, which looks pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of the fire bandana by 
maple stick, but it looks pretty great. Just a bit extended flames. Then we have the Damascus one, pretty cool as well. And of course, we can close these ones out for now. We then have received this one right here. This one just looks a little bit hilarious. One from Terabyte, pretty cool as well. And then the Checker Bandana, which is one of the most recent ones. And this one was just updated, uh, the plates, uh, red plate bandana from Bandite. So this one was one of the latest ones or last ones that we have really received from like the kind of bandana series thing, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, then we also have the Save the Earth one, the Checker Bandana, which is 40 Robux, and the only one by Bandites, which is pretty cool for 15. So I guess for now, kind of the, the Bandana series is like ending a little bit. It's not as popular as I expected it to be, if I'm completely honest. And it was fairly interesting to dive into this. Um, so I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had a bit of fun. I don't really want to stretch this video out longer than I have to. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.